RealAirCulture.com's coverage of the Western Canadian Farm Progress Show in Regina is brought to you by Morris. Our product, AgriSolution, is a newly registered product uh, that is new available on the Canadian market. It's a foliar uh, applied fertilizer. Um, a fer it's registered as a fertilizer supplement and it's unique in the respect that it's uh, CO2 fertilization from the, for, from the inside. Promotes the photosynthesis of the plant and um, by supplying the plant with increased levels of CO2. And uh, like we all know that in the atmosphere the CO2 levels are too low for ideal plant growth. And by um, using our product, um, it's applied to the leaf surface of the plant and uh, is, enters the plant through the stomata and then releasing uh, CO2 inside the plant. And so supplying the plant with a steady uh, supply of CO2 and through that we get, a, we get ideal plant growth. Like, uh, for example, canola, we see uh, an average yield increase of 16 to 18 percent. With wheat or cereals, we see uh, between 18 and 20 percent. And these are average numbers. That's not the best, the top, the best we've ever seen. These are average numbers from over the la collected over the last three years in more than 30 countries. Um, like potatoes, we see uh, 23 to 26 percent, so it's, uh, it's significant. Great effect that we also get is a significant reduction in water requirements of the plant, uh, which we see between 30 and 50 percent, just because there is less um, evaporation, less respiration of uh, moisture by the plant itself, and uh, that of course makes the plant or makes it an ideal product to use in, uh, in very dry uh, circumstances. But we also see that the, the stress resilience, the increased stress resilience, uh, also enables the plant to grow better in, um, under wet stress. No, there is no other product that uh, focuses on CO2 fertilization on the product. So we're, uh, we're the first product on the market. And um, so we expect others to come in eventually once they see what our product can do. But right now, there's really we're the only one having that product. And uh, Greenfield Fertilizer Corp is uh, exclusive importer of AgriSolution to Canada. Get sprayed onto the plant, as I said before. Probably um, we need leaf surface for it to work. So the plant uh, ideally has a certain size already before it's uh, being applied. Then it's sprayed onto the leaf surface. It enters the, um, through the stomata into the leaf, uh, into the inside of the leaf. And then in there we have a, a breakdown of the minerals releasing steady CO2 levels. Like AgriSolution is finely ground minerals. It comes in a very fine powder. It's dissolved in water. Um, however, it can be mixed with any other liquid application that you do with herbicides or um, fungicides or other liquid uh, plant, uh, yield um, boosters, yield enhancers. So it does not require a separate pass, which is, we believe, very important because it, uh, it doesn't mean using our product uh, translates into more work for the farmer. Uh, it depends on the crop. Uh, for the most common crops, it's, um, it requires, or we recommend, two applications. And, um, like, example, canola being the number one cash crop, uh, we, it requires two applications, a total of 4.9 pounds over the two applications. And uh, so we look for canola per acre. Input cost is about... Um, Twenty-three and a half dollars per acre, uh, but if you look at the, at the direct increase in yield and what that, uh, based on last year's number, yeah, we're looking at a 
gross increase of uh, $78 minus the $23, we're still over $50 per acre uh, of extra cash in the pocket for the farmers. Mm -hmm.